what up Z Clan everybody else? How you doing? Hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Outer Land. Oh wait, Outer Lands love what I'm talking about. <laughs> Outer World. On Supernova difficulty and on this episode we're gonna be doing Stranger in a Strange Land. So yeah, that's what it is. A uh, part of the main story. Well, in the previous episode we completed the fighting engineer, so this is where we kinda left off and now we gotta go oh we gotta go to the ship lol okay that's easy <laughs> uh where's the come on man fast travel yeah let's go boom and it might be a super short quest uh so we might collab it with two because it looks like we're done here on this island or whatever by the way, how can you have two two guys following you? Is it possible? Hey, man. Yo. Max. You cockroach, man. I saved your life. You don't want to talk to me? Oh, man. Captain, I have detected that Edgewater's power supply is now optimal. I applaud your willingness to invest your time in the local community. Alright. What can I do for you, Captain? I have the power. Do you know how to install a power regulator? Hell yeah. Outstanding, Captain. You just push the button. <laughs> your aptitude for engineering will prove invaluable in the event of another catastrophic engine failure. Our engine room is located behind you, across the cargo bay, up the ladders. All right, I'll be right back, baby. So, as so far as I understand, it gotta push two buttons, right? <laughs> All right, let's do this. Bam, 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 bam. Ooh, yeah. Keep that XP, XP coming. Ticket to anywhere achievement. Woohoo! Are we going to fly now? Yo, Max, you want to talk to me now? I got my ship. No? Okay, fine. You don't want to talk to me, man. Ah, baby, what you got for me? What can I do for you, Captain? I've installed the power regulator. All systems are operating within acceptable parameters. I am prepared to bring the unreliable into low altitude orbit. This should prove an adequate test of our flight capabilities. All right, let's go. Ooh, look at that! <laughs> My own personal ship. <laughs> Off we go. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. I still, although I still haven't killed those monkeys there. Dr. Phineas Wells. Good, I'll be waiting to hear from him. Ah, there you are. Hale and hearty and captain of your own ship. I see you're putting the unreliable to good use. Shame about her former captain. Horrible way to die. How are you feeling, by the way? I lost track of you in that cave back there. Experiencing any, uh, unnatural drippage? Perfectly normal side effect of thawing, I assure you. I go into slow-mo. <laughs> oh, that, yes, um, that's probably permanent. I wouldn't worry about it, though. I'm sure you're fine. Well. What you saw in Emerald Vale is happening all across the colony. Food shortages, lack of supplies, and basic necessities. We're dying. The chairman, the minister, and all their lackeys on the board are to blame. The Hope has some of the brightest minds Earth ever sent us. If we can revive the Hope's colonists, they can help us undo the board's mistakes. They can help us set things right. You need to get to Stellar Bay on Monarch. I have contacts there. <clears throat> They'll help me, help us, find the chemicals to revive your fellow colonists. Gladys Kelly, lovely woman, runs a cozy little black marketing outfit on the Groundbreaker. She can get you a nav key to land on Stellar Bay. Strictly speaking, Monarch is a moon, terraformed badly. And almost completely lawless. You'll love it. 
captains don't fly their own ships, you see. Your navigation <laughs> terminal handles the, uh, you know, navigation. Think of a nav key as a set of flight instructions. The board's been confiscating nav keys for Stellar Bay, so we must rely on unconventional means of acquisition. Hence, Miss Gladys Kalkelly. All right. Gladys and I have been doing business for years. Her smuggling credentials are unimpeachable. If anyone can get you a key to Monarch, it's her. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Excellent. I'll send her a wireless. Let her know you're coming. <laughs> a wireless? <laughs> By the way, oh. <laughs> I gave Captain Hawthorne a I'll send her a tweet. <laughs> Cutting edge technology years ahead of its time. I call it the holographic shroud. I'm sure it will prove remarkably useful to you. You'll find it in the captain's quarters. Thanks. Excellent. I'll contact you once you've found a way to get to Stellar Bay. If you have any questions, come see me in my lab. And remember, don't trust the board. They'll try to win you over with promises of wealth and power, but it's a lie. I like the that. <laughs> wealth and power. If we don't put a stop to them, they're going to run this colony to the ground. Transmission ended. If you are ready to depart, please select a destination on your navigation terminal. I right, got it. Yeah, level up. <laughs> all right, so we are going all the way for inspiration. Boom. Yeah, uh, I like the idea. Thank you very much. Uh, then we are going for perks and uh, what else do we have? 50 HP, tactical time. Then, then no, no, no. No, no. No. You become a very efficient source of goods. Maybe you should have been born. Unlock the ability to fast travel. Ah, I can't fast travel on cucumber mode. Whatever case, I mean only back to the ship, so what's the point of it? Uh make it vendor prices. Requires five previous perks. Oh, so I need to have these things. Okay, then. Uh, well, what I want to do. Increase my survivability. Oh, yo, I got Max on my team, too, now. Ha, <laughs> ha, love my friend. Oh, damn it. Health threat hack. Health. Uh, no. Apply. Okay, um, I didn't see that coming so soon okay man I'll, I'll give you my my thing then for now because you guys must survive <laughs> damn it I should go to another planet man that's it I'm not gonna be breaking uh, armor anymore oh dialogue skills plus five cool I like dialogue look at me now ha <laughs> ha <Lol. laughs> That actually looks dope. There you go. I'm actually gonna do it like this. I like the dialogue. He gonna be my warrior. Okay. Uh. Boo, 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 boo. Uh. Uh. Aggressive weapon. Ranged. Distance. Close. Aggressive. Yes. And. Uh, I uh, thank God I still have one of those plasma guns, because they seem to do a pretty good job. Actually, wait, I, I can give him this thing. Uh, wait, no. Switch guns. 
Boom. Here you go. Alright, now it would be nice to up his armor as well. Because these dudes can die permanently. How much cash do I have? Oh, I actually made some. Alright, Tinker. There you go. Mm, yeah, boom, boom. How many companions can you have in total? Okay, so... Let's go and pick up, do that optional thingy. What is that? Lager shot, lager shot. Project of this guy is you and your companion that gives you access to restricted areas. Provide you have the ID cat reach. Woo! 19 almost in the half thousand. Oh, bro. Here's where I can uh, drop a few things. Cool. Nice. My own personal bin. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, let's load up that space a little bit. I mean, get rid of it. Yeah, let's put the mods inside so I don't sell them by mistake. Later on when maybe I'll have the ability to sell goods on a higher value. So we got the water. Yo, where's my... Wait, that thing, that other thing I should sell. Hold on. Give me buy my tuna. And this thing I'm going to sell. Entertaining the way you drool. Alright. Oh, cool. Terra 2. Monarch. We were on Terra 2, right? Some lab. Ground Baker docking base. Oh, there we go. Welcome to the system. Breaker has approved our request for docking, Captain. You're free to disembark. All right. Yeah, let's go. But I think I'll initiate an unscheduled flight. Uh, select party. Oh, damn it. Oh, bro. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> Yo, I love it. <laughs> Smells like grease and unwashed bodies. Just as I remembered. Alright, so that's my ship. I can see loot over here. Please don't tell me I need the hack schmack. No, I don't. Oh, and a plasma rifle. Woohoo! Ah, oh, yeah. Woohoo! Ah, oh, yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> Alright. Maybe I'll be lucky enough to find some armor or something. Customs. Yo, let's poke around in this place. What you got here? Yo, man, can you look another way, please? Oh, man, there's just so many people here. Mm -hmm. Can you close the door? Don't you dare open that door. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Give me more, baby. Hey, I told you, do not open that door. You 
You almost got us busted here. Oh. Woo! Busted! Ah! I'm stuck! I'm sorry! Oh, let's check it out. Boom. Let's check out these few skills. I've had quite enough of you. Oh. Yo, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Man, you guys suck. I, it was just a little freaking thing, man. Why would you get so pissed? I just, just don't understand. No! Pavari, she down, man! No! Ah! <laughs> we didn't make it. <laughs> we got overrun. <laughs> Alright. Good thing I, I have a low... <laughs> oh, we gotta try stealing again. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was cool, though. That was fun. <laughs> oh, man. All right, we're going to try to steal stuff. Talk? You want to talk? Why? What happened? Hey, Captain. I heard that Groundbreakers got a real good engineer. A lady named June Lay Tennyson. And yeah, what about her? I was thinking that maybe I ought to meet her. If you got time to swing us by, I mean. I don't got much experience fixing actual spaceships. I bet you a can of Borston beans she could teach me all manner of stuff. Sure. Thanks, Captain. I'll be sure to make it worth your time. Did you want to talk about anything else before we moved on? Mm, no. Boom. I was hiding, man. How the hell did he bust me like that? Hey. <laughs> oh, you what? Got to be kidding me. Get go away. Uh Just leaving. Keep your hands to yourself. Don't open the goddamn door. Oh man. Stupid freaking companions. Reputation messed up cuz of you. No, actually that was your your fault. We got busted. Damn it. Yeah, I was just checking it out. Take it easy. Ooh. Vending machine, huh? Mm, but I'm broke, you see? Oof. Heavy machine gun. Oh, maybe I can change that laser. <laughs> I'll keep that. What is that? Hold up, man. I want to check what you got here in the stores. 
Ooh, what the hell is that? Tactical shotgun. All right. Armor. No armor. Stupid companions, man. Got me busted, man. Messed up my reputation. I should shoot him in the leg for that. What are you looking at? Restricted area. Hmm. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> Sneaky peeky, man. All right, my. Oh, we gotta die if we fall from here. Oh. Whoa, -ho. <laughs> bro, that's cool. A flamethrower. Oh my lord. <laughs> Hello. Oh, look at this dialogue skills. Ooh, yeah. I think I found myself a good, a good looking outfit. Well, uh, uh, definitely better what I have. It actually matches my, my all goody, you know. All right, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Where's Vic? Vic, man, you gotta get this flamethrower in the house. Check this out. Ooh, -hoo! Vic, my man, you dangerous. Look at it. Oh, he got to burn things to the ground. All right. Uh, I guess there's nothing there. There you go. I picked up this weird signal the other day. And tinker that flamethrower a little bit. Oh damn, you can't tinker anymore. That must be a really good weapon then. Alright, armor to hack stealth. Well, Here we go again. I might use that thing myself. You have found a ID cartridge on your shroud. Now you'll be automatically disguised when entering. Okay, cool. No. Broadcasting on a dead world full of monsters. Oh, that thing right there. <laughs> Lol, did you see that? Looking sharp. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> I love it. What the hell is that? Steal it. Take it. Oh, my greed is gone crazy mode. Woo! Rah! <laughs> We're all gonna die! <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> Take it all, give nothing back. Oh wait, so if you don't move... Ah... 
That's how it is. Okay. So if you don't move, that thing doesn't... Whoop! Bro, that, that is so dope. I love... Oh, uh, man. <laughs> Alright, break down. This thing, break down. This thing, break down. Oh, it's a laser pistol. Okay, cool. And now I have a trunk in my ship. So, uh... That's good. Ooh, damn! Hello. Try not to be distracted by the glare of the adverts. Lots of <laughs> <laughs> Too late for that. <laughs> All right, distracted. Hello. Hmm. Rest and go. Shoot. Ooh, can we rent it up there, bro? Yo. Another vending machine. Oh, look what we got here. 24. Whoo! Dodge, stealth skills. I like this one. This one looks nice. Look at that helmet, man. <laughs> Persuade? That's cool. I don't like those colors, man. I need some, like, you know, some dark thing, you know? Like red and black. Uh Okay, cool. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hold up, man. I don't want to talk to you yet. Oh, water and electricity. Where the hell are we going? Oh, restricted area, that's where. Medbay key card. The hell was happening here? Uh, where's the exit? Folks keep those clothes for a reason. Yeah, Oh, there's the exit there. Q. Q. 
damn it. This thing is locked. Sorry. Can we talk? Yeah, man, what's up? Captain, if I could trouble you for a moment of your time, while we're on the groundbreaker, I may have an idea for how we could find a translator. I've been thinking on that. There's a former so uh, infamous philosopher scholar who fled Terra 2 some years ago. He's an expert on Bakonu. He's also who told me of the journal's presence in Emerald Vale. If anyone in this colony could translate that book, it would be him. That's a good question. Fortunately, we're in the perfect place to start. This is where I'd go if I wanted to get off Terra 2. Great place to pick up a ride to Hephaestus, Scylla, even Monarch. All I need is access to a data cartridge from the security terminal. Their easily hackable system keeps a registry of all crew manifests for both arrivals and departures. All right, man. I'll comb the last six months of departure manifest to track the philosophist's off-world destination. Sounds good. Let's go. Thank you, Captain. Let's get out of here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Whew. Please don't make a scene, Doctor Fenhill. The hell? Well, sorry about the heat. Chief Tennyson will get the radiators fixed soon. Of course, this heat sure makes a zero G brew extra refreshing. <laughs> it's an ale that's good for what ails you. Oh, and it's not the best choice, it's Spacer's choice. Taste the freedom. He do not sound exciting. <laughs> Sometimes I forget. Straight. Uh, have a look. What you got, mommy? Oh. Custom accessory light, cop red mask, of head aware. <laughs> Hello. I'll take the water. Cash in the house. Right. Bro, you can steal all this stuff. <laughs> Let's check this plate out as well and call it a day and continue with uh we'll do a side quest for now let's hope bar vendor i'm not winded honest my uh boot was untied would hate for you to get left behind or architect of this become lost Bro, this place is confusing.
This guy's a vendor too. You know that sound when you snapped on an injector oh. clip? Oh. That's how you know your Woo. weapon loves you back. I got a full line of weapon modifications I'd be happy to show you. Trade. Alright, she got weapons, man. She ain't got no armor. And she's got... Oh, 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 oh. Alright. Maybe there's a armor vendor? Hello. It's always fucking freezing in the base. Man, you just gotta swear, don't you? I was wondering what they do with their weight. I guess they just chuck it down here. Oh look at that little rascal. Oh, how cute. I told you I'm not shooting those guys anymore. Oh my god, this guy got beheaded. The, oh, bro, this place is huge. Go back to Byzantium, you gold plated bastards. Yeah, no one wants you on ground. And you see this man. We'll go food. Wow. It must be be more machinery. It must be housed on a sub level. I could spend all day in here and not have looked at half the best steps. It's all pretty worn though. That is insane, man. Sealed. Let me take a look at the map. Okay. Oh. Sup, Tinker Tinker? Breakdown. Oh. I guess this is the armor well, vendor. Someone who's taking their share of cuts and bruises. Hello. Yeah. Maybe it's a bit. I'd like to take a look. only testament to its durability. We also have a line of specialized melee weapons. Shop. Ooh, Dodge medium, light, heavy, twenty-four. Look at that Dodge stealth. Oh, look at that. I like the colors. 11. Lock picking. Stealth skills. Melee. Stealth. Defense. Interesting. Armory increases body armor and helmet armor ratings against physical damage. Cool. Catch you later, man. Ah! Oh. You're killing those poor bastards, aren't you? If you're hungry, you've come to the right place. I've got a fresh ground batch of Spratwurst cooking. They're too fried to lock in the juices. How about a grinder's dozen? Trade. Fresh from the grinder, any hour. Uh, no. By the way, I, I don't I have this, like some junk or something? No, I don't. Okay, bye. Okay, she only got food and water. And expensive too. Sublight, salvage. Oh, neat! They got stuff in here I ain't seen in ages. Now this should prove interesting, to say the least. Uh, 
Alright, looks like we are going to be calling it the end for this episode right here. And we will continue in the next episode. We will do companion quests and we will start off... Mm, this one right here. Drinking... Oh, man. So, fire wine. <laughs> Alright, folks, I hope you enjoyed the show. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody can see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So, do have that in mind. And damn, I just noticed I'm thirsty as hell. <laughs> so, I'll see y'all later. Bye.